welcome back to my channel. This is Melissa, otherwise known as Mulissa or Mew, and today we are playing another installment of my current household. Do I have a name for this family or series? No. Anyway, <laughs> uh, picking up where we left off in the last current household, um, Lariana just aged up to be a teenager, so I gave her a makeover. That's all that's happened since then. And I just thought she was pretty cute. She's very laid back and simple. Um, her favorite color is purple, so she's rocking that power ball. Now, please don't yell at me, but her hoodie, the hood of her hoodie kind of clips through her hair. I didn't realize that, so if that bothers you, I apologize. But I thought it was really funny because her mom made this disgusting... <laughs> <laughs> disgusting cake for her birthday which she did not want at all and uh she <laughs> everybody's going for the pink cake even chase is getting some pink cake <laughs> nobody wanted her nasty carrot cake or whatever it is oh sugar-free carob coconut cake which actually i love co coconut so i would probably eat some but uh, apparently that's not the case with the rest of them, so I'm gonna just have her put that away, or actually I'll just, uh, I'll just shove her in there. Um, so yes, this is our adorable girl. I love her so, so much. She's so, so cute. Um, she's very happy because it's her birthday. And, um, let's see, I think we should get her a job. So let's go ahead and do that. Um... No, we're going to find a job. Let's see. I think she would do maybe babysitting. Because she already kind of has to look after Edison a little bit, you know? Um, yeah, we'll do the babysitter. Mod, uh, not mod, but that. Uh, so we can get rid of that now. We will just toss these toys into Edison's play box. I'm really, really intrigued to see what, um, let's see, I really want to know what our sister got us for her birthday, but we'll probably not see this in the episode. I don't feel like waiting around for that, but we're going to go ahead and, um, give him this void critter although i don't think yeah i need maybe i need to open it first what is it it's nymphaea so let's see if we can give it to him now don't actually know and then i'd like to adopt him as a care dependent there we go now we can give it to him like look i uh got this a while ago i thought you might want it more than i would and i do think she might know that london is wanting to buy him a uh void critter battle station just to kind of suck up to him so uh i think we'll do an inside joke real quick although uh maybe get to know him but mm, i don't think i don't know that she should be a care dependent but it looks like she might already be because she's got the parenting option so Let's go ahead and go to Manage Worlds. I want to go drop in on both Marcus and London. Um, Marcus has been a pretty good guy about visiting his kids, at least uh, Jackie's kids, his and Jackie's kids, the triplets. Um, when I've been playing with them, he's been very actively asking, you know, can I come over? Can I chat? And uh, when he comes over, I make sure they all interact with him, so that's good. But I don't know how active he's really been in Edison's life, which is very sad. So, you know, it makes, makes me kind of sad, but, um, you know, life is not fair. <laughs> and he was a teenager both times that he had, that he, you know, got some girls pregnant. So, you know can't really live with that sometimes. So he, I think, lives in Oasis Springs. That's where Pixel Smiles lives. Um, this is where he lives. I don't think there's really much to see here, quite honestly, because I never really de de decorated it much because he's really not very uh, rich. <laughs> 
and also uh, he's still got stuff from when um what's his face Edison would used to live here but obviously as you can see living quarters are a little scarce so you know he has like some nice objects that he could have sold but he really didn't feel the need to he's got a picture of London here um, I do want to know what his relationship with her is. Looks like they're pretty good. Obviously not good with Jackie. They are broken up, bad romance. But yes, this is his girlfriend. Apparently that uh, they are exclusive. So I'm just going to have him go ahead and sell these items real quick because he really could use the cash. Really can't afford to, you know, not have the money here. And then I just want to double check on how he's doing with his job. This is him, by the way. He's pretty He's pretty cute. Like, he was a townie, and I, bar I hardly retouched him. But this is what we got. Oh, yes, that's right. He's a mixologist, and he works pretty soon. Uh, looks like he's getting kind of close to a promotion, so that's good. This is a bro, active and dastardly. He's a foodie. Uh, he's not too serious of a guy so um yeah he doesn't really have too many friends either I feel like he was friends with Chaz for a hot minute there but I don't quite remember but anyway I just wanted to show you him real quick but we are actually going to switch over to London I shouldn't have saved dang it why did I do that so London has a very big apartment of which she I guess she can afford but um, she doesn't, she hasn't furnished it completely um, because she hasn't had the funds to. Um, but she got this apartment at a good rate. She technically kind of kicked the people, the previous tenants out because... It was, I forgot who they were that were living there, but I think she kind of sweet-talked the landlord a little bit and kind of got her way in there. So I don't think she came by it honestly. Um, but I'm, I, I, have, I really have not played with her in a long, long time, so I'm interested to see uh, who she has a relationship with. So this is her apartment. We will just zoom in there. Um, I want to know if she has multiple boyfriends. I feel like she does. I just can't remember for sure, for sure. But I think that life is going to catch up to her pretty quickly here. All right, so this is what we have so far for her apartment. Uh, this is her bedroom, very simple, but you can see that she has the romantic aura going. So, you know, like we said earlier, she's a little promiscuous, so that's needed. Um, this is her kitchen. I think it's really cool. It's kind of windowed into the dining area. Um, again, romance going right there. Um, this is like her studio. Uh, where she works out, does yoga, and then we also just have this set up to take pictures. And then this is Edison's old room. Um, obviously, she spared no expense for him. She really loves him. We're going to put this in our inventory so we can give it to him next time we see him. Because he would probably enjoy having that back in his life. Uh, there's nothing really else that he would want. No one, there's no one to send to bed, I know, is it sad? It's so sad. Okay, so let's open this up. Are there any other toys he would want? Probably not. But she does have some, ah, yes, as you can see, she does some promiscuous photography. Um, she does know Jackie. I think they were friends for a hot second there. And then there's her and Marcus. I'm just going to put those back in that stack. And then let's take a look and see what's up here. So mom, obviously BFF. Uh, Masato and Kengo. We also have romantic relationships with, as well as, oh, Alexander Goth. Eliza Pancakes, too. So 
Um, I would assume she's trying to get close to Alexander for the money. So that's interesting. And then there's her dad. Yeah. There's Edison. She loves him so much. I think Bailey was supposed to be a good friend, but I can't quite remember. But um, we're going to have her come take a picture. Simstagram had a photo taken of her feminine posing. Just see if she's still got it or what. Oh, same one as last time. Why am I not surprised? I'll just zoom out a little bit. There. Beautiful, darling. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Let me take a look at that, actually. How does that look? I can't see. I can't freaking see. I need it to go over there. There. That'll be her thin inspiration going forward. Should we add a frame? Mm, no, we'll just keep it like that for now. Um, Let's see. I had an idea of what I wanted to do here, but I can't quite remember. Let's see, are bills due or anything like that? That's us, no. I think, I think, I don't know, I don't think Marcus is available to chat because I think he's at work. But let's just, uh, uh, we'll send him a quick text and then for Alexander, we'll exchange our, give him our new number. And then we'll send him a happy text just to see if he's interested What's in hanging at? out, maybe. Miss <laughs> Linda and I won't give your number to anyone else. Nice outfit, bruh. Oh, and there's ah. her sister. So cute. She's independent. Unbelievable. <gasps> Yay. Oh. The gardens. Great. My favorite. <laughs> That's fine. What happens at the gardens stays at the gardens. It's very, it can be very romantic there, so, you know, it's a good, it's, it's good, it's good. So, once this loads, I want to see what other outfits she has. I definitely want to see what other outfits he has if he's wearing that top hat he had in his profile picture, because that ain't going to fly with me. Oh gosh, my neck. Oh man, okay. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, he's good. He's good. He's good. He's good. Okay. Um, what other outfits do you have? You have to have more than one everyday outfit, right? Okay. Well, I think she'd want to look a little more classy for him. So we'll put on this guy. Very pretty, pretty, pretty. I like that outfit actually quite a bit. Um, hello, Alexander. How are you? We'll embrace him. Oh. I haven't seen you in so long. What is this? Kiss neck? Oh my. I really hope no one gets mad at us, because it seems like he might be married. Um, let's see. Let's add him to our group, just so we can do what we need to do. I'm gonna say... Let's, uh, let's, uh, let's go here together real, real, real quick. Just real quick. Where's that place with the, here it is, the easel. Oh, Bernard is here. Oh, and he doesn't have a last name anymore. That's really interesting. Nice painting, man. I love it. That's awesome. Okay, so they're going to go there together. I really just want him to go there by himself, uh, so that she can use the bathroom. Okay, so go use the potty. I don't want him to leave is the issue. Okay, so let's come over and attempt to seduce him for sure. That's good. For some reason, I bet she won't wash her hands. Nope, none of that. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Okay, I don't like that that guy's right there. Like, seriously, go away. And he's there, so, like, what the heck? I'm just trying to be romantic. Maybe we could go to this garden together. Let's, uh, ooh, can we toss a coin in there? No, but we could go here together. I'm going to have her ask him to be her boyfriend. 
for sure. I just heard something very strange. Are we there yet? Okay, we're there. Where is he? Is he coming? Alexander, hello? <laughs> Did I lose him somewhere along the way? Okay, there he is. Okay, that's that's fine. Oh, there's my cat. Um, We'll invite him to stay the night, I guess. I don't know why he didn't come all the way over. It's so annoying. I'm trying to get away from people. Ugh, go away. Okay, cool. So... This is Nack and brighten his day. We're just gonna ask him to be our boyfriend too. We're just gonna pretend we don't know about all the stuff we see in the tabloids about him and his partner. Okay. Okay. Sweet boyfriend. Okay, so. We're gonna go woohoo in the bush. Wait, does... Okay, no, he does not have an apartment key, that girl. That's good. I was really worried for a second there because she gets a little promiscuous and I think that if he had an apartment key, that could end badly for her. My goodness, you guys are really going to the very back of the place. Wow. They are seriously private about this. Okay, any second now. Woo! All done, okay. So I wonder if we could do something regarding, yes, there. Please, please leave your spouse. I'm so much better than them. I think he might be with a, what are you doing, Billy? What have you got? His spouse, perfect. He's gonna leave them, but I can't remember if it's a he or a she. It looks, it looked like a he, but I don't know. Uh, express fondness and compliment his appearance. Uh, we're gonna try for a baby on the spot because she's trying to lock this guy down. She wants what he's got, you know. Suppose we could have tried in the bush, but oh, she's getting ready. He's getting ready. There we go. Boom! Fireworks! Whoa! Take a nap. Heck no. Um. We don't have enough friendship? Okay, well, we will work on that. Actually, we already invited him to come stay the night, so let's just go ahead and travel home. We'll bring him with us. Oh, now I see why she was becoming friends with Bailey, the girl, because she's a Caliente, and the Calientes are so up her alley. I would assume she could learn a lot from the Calientes since they live her kind of lifestyle. If you guys are aware of Sims 2, you'll know that they were very much about sleeping with um, Mortimer Goth. And also, um, they were with Don Lothario for a good chunk of time, too. So they were pretty promiscuous and gold digging as well. So let's go ahead and head back to the apartment. Gosh, I love Chewy so much. That's where I get my cat's food from, and they are so punny. There's so many funny puns about animals. It's cute. Okay, so we are almost home. I want to... I don't know. I, I need to get her a pet. That's, like, my next step. I want to I wanna pretend like he got her the pet. Like, Alexander got her the pet as kind of like a pre-engagement engagement gift kind of like uh once i finalize my divorce i will give you a ring here's what i can give you in the meantime so he's probably still living with his uh spouse of the time 
but we are going to go ahead and call up and let's see let's hire a service she wants an adorable little fuzzy white puppy so let's adopt a dog absolutely Philly, what are you getting at? I'm so sorry if that's bothering you guys. Um, Magoo is adorable, but none of them are really what she has in mind. So I might have to just make... Oh, that's so cute. Siberian Husky. Or... Corgi would be cute, too. A Chihuahua. Oh, no. Maybe we should get her a Chihuahua. A neutered Chihuahua. I don't know. I think I'm just gonna get her a white puppy in Cass and he'll be the one who have who bought it for her. But I need to end this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a comment and a like down below letting me know. If you really enjoyed, hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out and it makes my day. So thank you so much in advance for that. And I will see you guys all next time. Bye guys. <laughs>